we get told all, all the time to trust our gut. But what does that really mean? It means you've got this feeling or this intuition about a person, a place, an, an opportunity. Oftentimes that feeling is right, but why? Well, science is now telling us that the gut, like the second brain, where is 80 to 90% of all serotonin made? You ready? The gut, right? So the gut is really important because here's where it gets fascinating is the gut actually is right. The gut isn't just for digestion now, is it? And there's many times that I should have just trusted my gut. I don't want you to make that same mistake as I have. I remember not too long ago, gut health and the microbiome were seemed kind of quackery. But now gut health and the gut microbiome is now getting its own subspecialty in GI. Look how things change. I always say evidence-based medicine is great. I teach it in the classrooms. It's the substance and base of knowledge that we use. It keeps the patient safe and it helps create a standard of care. But the downside is it takes 10, 15, 20 years for it to become usable and it takes tens of billions of dollars to create. So it's up to us to help create the evidence-based model using our own anecdote as well.